The rest two types of normalization that is fourth normal form 4NF and the fifth normal form 5NF. What are the basic things to be noted in these two normal forms and how they can be determined that whether a relation is in 4NF or 5NF form. Hello everyone, I am Sukanya from GoEdhub Technologies and in this video we are going to discuss about the rest two parts of normalization. So the first is fourth normal form 4NF. Fourth normal form is a level of database normalization when no trivial multi-value dependency other than candidate key. It builds the first three normal forms 1NF, 2NF and 3NF which we have discussed in the previous video and the BCNF normal form. It states that in addition to a database meeting, the requirements of BCNF must contain more than one multi-valued dependency. So it majorly focuses on the multi-value dependency of a database management system. A relationship will be in 4NF if the BCNF normal form has no multi-value dependency. For a dependency A to B, if for a single value of A, multiple values of B exist, then the relation will be multi-valued dependency. Now here comes a new term that what do we mean by multi-valued dependency and what are the constraints in it. A table is said to have multi-valued dependency if the following conditions are true which are for a dependency B belongs to A for a single value of A multiple values of B exist then the table is have to be multiple dependency. That means if one single value of A there reflects several values of B in attributes or in columns then the table is having multi-valued dependency of column A. Also a table should have at least three column for it to have a multi-valued dependency which is true as much number of columns are there there are chances that multi-valued dependency could be there. Similarly and the relation R ABC there is multi-valued dependency between A and B and B and C should be independent of each other. There can be dependency but B and C should be independent of each other similarly for A and B. If all the above mentioned three conditions are true then any relation or table is said to have a multi-valued dependency and in 4NF form we have to eliminate that particular multi-valued dependency if existing BCNF is having such kind of dependency. For example if you take this movie table having column names as or attributes as movie name shooting location and the listing. So for example there are movie 1 which is shot in UK having listing comedy. Similarly the movie 1 also the shooting location is UK and the listing is thriller 2. For movie 2 which is shot in Australia is having a listing of action and the movie 2 has a listing of Australia and the crime genre. Similarly, the movie 3 is shot in India and there is drama. So this is basically in O1NF. There are no dependency. Dependency is only in movie 1 and movie 2. The above is not in, above particular mentioned relation is not in 4NF form. Since it has more than one movie that can have same listing and many shooting locations may have the same movie. So if we want to convert this following table to 4NF, what we have to do is we have to create two tables. How? One is movie shooting and other is movie listing. So we can eliminate the dependency. For example, movie 1 is shot in UK. Movie 1 is also shot in UK. Similarly for movie 2 which is shot in Australia respectively. And the movie 3 is shot in India. And the listing could be made as movie 1 is having comedy listing 2 and thriller 2. Movie 2 similarly has action and crime. And the movie 3 is having drama. Now the violation is removed from the tables are in 4NF form. And they can be further reduced to. The next and the last normal form is fifth normal form or projected normal form. A relation R is in fifth NF form or 5NF if and only if every joint dependency in R is implied by the candidate keys of R. A relation decomposed into two relation must have a lossless join property which ensure that no surprises or the extra tuples are generated which means no extra tuple should be generated that is a lossless join property and relation are reunited through a natural join. So the properties or how can we say that a relation R is in 5NF form only and only if it satisfied the following condition that it has to be in 4NF form which we have discussed just now and it could be further non-loss decomposed that is it should have a joint dependency between the relation. Now if we check that the below relation violates 5NF form how does it do? If David is having employee skill Java and he is assigned to work E145 
Similarly, there are E146 having different employee skill and employee name assigned to a same work. Then the relation is not in 5NF form. So how can we decompose the particular relationship in 5NF form? We can make three tables of that. Employee name and the skills. Similarly, employee name and the job ID and the employee job that which job it is listed to according to the employee skill so when we do that then decomposition or our joint dependency is actually made as employee name with employee skills the name of employee with the employee job and similarly the skills are associated with the job so when we do that then dependency is already on the relations are having joint dependency which are so they are not in 5nf that would mean that a joint relation of our three relation is equal to the original relation employee that should have the original relationship employee so and by the end of this video we have studied about all the dependencies in the previous video we have looked about 1nf 2nf 3NF and BCNF and in this video we have looked about 4NF and 5NF normalization in database management system. For next uh, queries or next tutorial we will look into other videos. Thank you.